Hi everybody, this is Bob from Buckeye Sports Center. Today I'm really excited to talk to you guys about the Stingray 206cc. So this is a center console Stingray uh, that is really kind of great for in the lake use, bay use, uh, maybe even a, a calmer day on Lake Erie, um, but really gives you a cool center console boat, a lot of premium features, but really a good economic valuable, you know, value price on this. So, you know, let's take a look inside. Okay, we move into the bow of the Stingray 206. Um, right now, again, the versatility is another thing I really like about this boat. You know, while it is kind of geared a little bit more toward the fishing uh, boat customer, um, definitely this has a lot of family friendly amenities as far as, you know, seating configurations and cushions and stuff like that. So this particular setup is basically all the cushions are on here. All these cushions can be removed to be create just a big flat uh, fishing deck. There's actually a pedestal fishing seat under here too. So if you wanted to be an elevated kind of bass style fishing seat, come to this boat. So, you know, if you're in the lake or bass fishing, you know, you can set it up, leave, you know, store the cushions away and, you know, call it a day and just make it more of a fishing boat. Uh, but, you know, while it's being used for family, you know, a couple cool, you know, cool little, um, you know, little mini cooler thing, you know, here, you know, little storage compartments, um, you know, storage compartments down here that you can put, you know, uh, tackle boxes and that type of stuff courtesy lights, um, there's actually, let me open this puppy up here, big live well up here in the bow, uh, which is really slick. Again, you know, really, really nice. We've got the snap-in uh, seagrass flooring, so you can either pull that out for the all fiberglass flooring, you know, kind of use it however you want. But, you know, again, setting it up for fishing or family use. Uh, as we move kind of around, you see the, the nice uh, on-the-go rod storage on both sides, nice padded side panel, you know, so that if you're walking and you kind of hit your knee against it, it's going to be comfortable to walk on. You know, on the transom area, we've got, you know, actually a jump seat back here, which is really slick and it's nice because it's really tall. So I feel really comfortable in me being a little bit taller, bigger guy. I've got a nice grab handle here um, and I feel comfortable in the seat rather than having one that's kind of going up halfway up my back. Um, additional live well or bait well here in the back, which is real slick. Again, these cushions here come out. So if you wanted to make it a complete um, uh, battery storage in some of your uh, bilge areas down there. Um, but if you want to make it more of a complete rear deck, you could, you know, nice big uh, cooler built in underneath the seat. Um, we've got a ski pole option here that's included on this boat. So uh, you can uh, ski with the family uh, with the outboard in the back. This boat will scream along really, really nicely with the Mercury 150 horsepower engine. So you're gonna see really, really good speeds on this boat. Stingray has their patented Z-plane hull, which uh, really, really creates a lot of good efficiency um, and uh, really makes this boat get up and go well with the 150 horsepower. Uh, we move around, we see multiple rod holders, obviously one, two, three, four in the back of the uh, uh, driver's chair. We see four, two on each side for built into the gunnels. We also see four up on the T-top. So, you know, plenty of, of rod area to utilize that. Um, you know, really, really cool T-top. You know, definitely one that, to be honest, you know, this is normally a T-top that I'll find on a boat that's maybe twice as big or, you know, more like a 24 to 26 foot boat. Um, so really, really heavy duty T-top. A little kind of lockable glove box up here. You know, some of your lights and switches up on the top here. Uh, you know, nice, nice coverage on the T-top. Um, you know, we've got a adjustable tilt wheel, depending on how you want to sit. If you want to sit kind of standing up, more of a leaning style, you can do this. You can have the, thing, this, the, the uh, steering wheel like this. You've got the little knob control, so some people like to control using that. Um, we kind of have the, the console completely open, depending on whatever electronics you want. We do have the Mercury gauge system off to the right, but you can put a big fish finder on there, pick your own uh, you know, setup on there uh, for this boat. But, um, or if I wanted to steer it, more traditional, sit down, get this thing going like this. And now I've got a more traditional thing. Well, again, comfortable little spot for my legs. Uh, plenty of grab handles, nice courtesy light up there. So it's a really a nice, um, nice console, nice, uh, nice, nice center console. There's storage also here on the uh, starboard side. Actually, no, I'm going to the other side, open it up. So that opens up, you can see your fishing chair in there. All right, so, but a big storage, if you wanted to put a porta potty down there, you could, or just use it for cushion storage or whatever you might do. So overall, just a great, great value here. 
in the 206 Stingray Center Console. Um, again, great boat for inland lake application or light lake area use or bay use. Um, you know, very, very versatile in how you can fish it. It's, it's not super deep on the inside, so you can definitely net fish easily. You know, sometimes some of these center consoles get so big and so deep that they're hard to fish out of, and this is definitely not one of those. So um, thanks for checking out the Stingray 206 with us at Buckeye Sports Center. For more information, visit our website to view our inventory, buckeyesportscenter.com. Uh, check out our YouTube page. Thanks again for watching.